Congress's FY 2025 National Defense Authorization Act authorizes a path to 381 manned warships and 134 unmanned vessels by 2045, a decisive bump from today's 291. How? Three levers. One, workhorse production, Ingalls and Bath Ironworks are locked into a five-year multi-year for DDG-51, Flight 3 destroyers, each fitted with Spy-6 radars that triple sensitivity against low-flying cruise missiles. Two, Frigate Fever, Fincantieri's Constellation class, FFG-62 slices the cost curve, $1.2 billion buys 32 VLS cells, an AN Spy-7 array, and the reach to escort convoys across the Philippine Sea. Three, next-gen Leviathan. The DDG-X, just unveiled without its 5-inch gun to free deck space for hypersonic launchers, will move 12 megawatts of integrated power, enough to fire 300 kilowatt lasers from bow and stern. But quantity is useless without survivability. Hence the Columbia-class SSBN, a ghostly 21,000-ton Sentinel whose electric drive whispers at less than 110 decibels. The first hull, USS District of Columbia, faces an 18-month delay, yet still promises a 2085 deterrent life, insurance that no adversary can black out the American homeland without gambling extinction. Mass needs brains. That brain is Project Overmatch, the Navy's slice of joint all-domain command and control. In February 2025, the project inked a Five Eyes data sharing pact. Australia, Canada, New Zealand, the UK, and the US now pour code into a single DevSecOps pipeline. Imagine an F-35C spotting a planned destroyer, beaming coordinates through a laser comm link to a Virginia-class sub, which then flick-fires a CPS boost glide round, all before the target's radar completes its rotation. Latency goal, under 10 seconds from sensor to shooter, fleet-wide. The initiative hinges on tactical edge clouds strapped to every combatant and AI-assisted fusion nodes that sift terabytes of SAR, ELINT, and acoustic pings. Overmatch turned heads at RIMPAC 24 where Allied ships executed 32 multinational kill chains in a single afternoon exercise, proof that code can multiply steel. Deterring YJ-21s means outrunning or outmaneuvering them. The sword, in 2027, conventional prop strike, CPS, will roar from Block 5 Virginia subs, an unclassified goal of Mach 16 over 1,700 nautical miles. SSP's April 2025 brief confirms the missile is on track, integrated via the Virginia payload module. The Shield, March 26, 2025, Aegis destroyer USS Pinckney tracks a live hypersonic surrogate and performs a simulated kill with the upgraded SM-6, Block 1B Seeker. MDA calls it the nation's only near-term hypersonic defense.